God, you dumb bell. You didn't tell him to leave the gun. I don't know why I told him to leave the gun. I told him exactly. him to leave the gun. Just like you told him, kid. I don't know why he didn't. I don't know why. I told him just like you told him. You told him to do it in the front of the head, and why did he do it in the back of the head? It's so simple. The front is the front, the back is the back. Man, he has to make it look like he done himself. It just looks like murder. It's not supposed to be that way. You hear? I told him the front of the head. I said the front of the head, just like this, just like you told me. I, I promise you, I promise you, I swear on my children. No, 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 no. I swear on my children, gang. Sit on it, sit on it, sit on it, sit And don't swear on your children. It makes you look foolish. Because I think you're full of shit. I don't, know. I don't think there's anyone else out there. I think, I think it's just me and you. That's right. I think it's just me and you. And you know what? You're gonna have to catch me yourself. I, we don't have time for this. Oh, that's good. That's good. Tell me what you want me to see, huh? I wouldn't lie to you. Look, you're wearing a wedding ring. You're wearing a wedding ring, Carl. You lied to me about that. Did you lie about that? You asked me if I had a family. I did, but I don't anymore. Come here with your laptop computer and your malaria medicine and your little bottles of hand sanitizer. You think you're gonna change the outcome, huh? Let me tell you something. You sell blood diamonds too. Really? Yeah. Tell me, how is that? Who do you think buys the stones that I bring out? Dreamy American girls who all want a storybook wedding and a big shiny rock. It's like the ones they see in the advertisements of your politically correct magazine. So please, don't come here and make judgments on me, all right? I provide a service. The world wants what we have, and they want it cheap. We're in business together. Get over yourself, darling. Mama, wake up! Mama, stop it now! No, I, I, I thought I was supposed to tell the truth here, you if are. only fucking you here. You are, Christ, yes, When a guy okay. comes in here against every, every instinct of, of privacy, of self-reliance that he has, and what do you do? What do you do, honey? You send him off on the street to score smack? Is that what you do? You're fucking ridiculous. Two pills? Great. Why don't you just give me a bottle of scotch and a handgun to blow my fucking head off? Are we done here with this psychiatry you bullshit? Know what? You what, can what the leave. fuck did I just put myself through? I'm fucking out. Come in with the milk. 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 He is to open the bag with his right hand and hold the bag out to me at a 45 degree angle so I may reach into the bag without without touching the paper. <clears throat> Repeated from the beginning. Repeated from the beginning. Repeated from the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> tonight, but that you can't believe. Mr. Moby, would you be so kind as to collect the pistol hanging off these boys' hips here? Thank you ever so much. Doctor. Where were we? Jackass. 
Yes. I do believe you were just getting ready to make me a proposition to Bob Broomhilda. Christ! Fuck! Oh, shit. Damn it, Rick. I swear to God. Fucking lines. Embarrass yourself like that in front of all those goddamn people. Well, you were drinking all night. Fucking drinking again. Eight goddamn fucking whiskey sours. <sighs> fucking bullshit. <laughs> You're a fucking miserable drunk. You fucking remember your fucking lines. I practiced them and now I don't look like I goddamn practiced them. You're sitting there like a fucking baboon. <laughs> I hate fucking whiskey sour. I couldn't stop at fucking three or four of eight. Why? You're a fucking alcoholic. You fucking drink too much, huh? Every fucking night, every fucking night. That's it. That's fucking it. That's fucking it. You stop drinking right now. All right? Make a promise to yourself you're going to stop fucking drinking. Oh, fuck. oh, fuck. <laughs> fucking warriors who will not hang up the phone until their client either buys or fucking dies! <laughs> Let me tell you something. There is no nobility in poverty. I have been a rich man and I have been a poor man and I choose rich every fucking time. Because at least as a rich man, when I have to face my problems, I show up in the back of a limo wearing a $2,000 suit and a $40,000 gold fucking watch. <laughs> now if anyone here thinks I'm superficial or materialistic, Go get a job at fucking McDonald's, cause that's where you fucking belong. So you listen to me and you listen well. Are you behind on your credit card bills? Good, pick up the phone and start dialing. You be ferocious. You be relentless. You be telephone fucking terrorist. Now let's knock this motherfucking